Hey guys, it's Anna. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing a little video for you guys showing you how I clean my brushes. So there are two types of cleaning your brushes. There's deep cleaning and spot cleaning. So in this video, I'm going into depth for both, when to use both, how to use both, and just like how I prefer to do it and what works best for me. So if you guys want to learn how to clean your brushes, then go ahead and keep watching. So first I'm going to talk about spot cleaning and this one is from Sonia Kashi. You can buy it at the drugstore. So what you do is spray it on some paper towel, rub your brush in it, and then it cleans the surface. This will not get rid of germs and deep cleaning, but it will clean it enough so you can move on to your next color. First thing you need is a plate and then you need to get some dish soap. This is antibacterial dish soap, so this is what will kill all the germs in your brushes. Then we're taking some olive oil and this is what's going to condition the brushes. So take about half as much as you took of the dish soap and just mix those together on your plate. Deep cleaning your brushes is something you should do just every now and then. You don't need to do it all the time, but it is good to clean up these dirty brushes. Okay, so I always start off with my biggest brushes, which are the face ones, and you're just going to want to dab it in that mixture. Make sure you get some soap and some olive oil, and then you're just going to want to massage it into your hand until it gets kind of frothy like it would in your hair, and then you want to lay it down on a paper towel to set in and move on to the next one. So I just repeat this process until I'm done with all of my brushes and you really want to take your time with each brush. Make sure you really get into all of the bristles and wash it really well. Once you get to the eye brushes, you're more likely to have some colorful brushes from some eye looks. As you can see here, I had a red shadow in this brush. Just whenever that happens, just wash off your hand and continue for the next brush. Once I'm done scrubbing each of the brushes, I just let them sit on the paper towel so that the soap can really soak in and we can get the best wash possible. So while my brushes are sitting, I'm going to move on to my sponges. So there are two ways that I do this, but first you just want to get the sponge wet and the first way is just dab it into that mixture we made from the dish soap and the olive oil. You just want to scrunch this in your hand, rinse it out and just keep repeating that until the water coming out of the sponge is clear. The other method I really like is using that Sonia Kashik spot cleaning spray and I just spray that all over the sponge and again just massage it in and rinse out the sponge and you just want to keep doing this until the water is clear again. Alright now moving on to rinsing out your brushes. So you're kind of going to do the same movement that you did while washing the brushes. You're just going to swirl it around in your hand, massage your fingers through the bristles. You really just want to make sure all of the hairs are clean and there's no more soap left in it. Once all of the soap is out, I always make sure to just squeeze any excess water out and then your brush is clean and it's so fun seeing how they turn white. So I'm just going to repeat this process for all of my brushes as well and really make sure you take as much time as you need to on each brush because it's so important that all of the soap and oil comes out. During this whole process, make sure you keep the brush downwards because you don't want water seeping up into the actual brush. You don't want it to loosen the glue that keeps the bristles in or get into the handle. Once your brushes are clean, just lay them flat on a clean paper towel and leave them to dry. So that is it for this video you guys, thank you so so much for watching. If you liked this video and it helped you guys out, make sure to give it a thumbs up down below. Also don't forget to leave a comment about what you guys want to see next. Make sure you subscribe before you leave and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys! Uh -oh.